it was like 26 degrees. Did you record that? I did. Oh. This is Sarah and Parents' vlog, because Kuho is spending the day and night at Mino's house. So we're hitting up Costco. favorite things to do. Backyard reading. Oh my god, it's so nice out today. <gasps> we came to eat lunch. So there's a Korean mart. I'm curious. They even have free and ice cream. Look. Watermelon bar. Jaws bar. This is the one that I've been eating in Korea. They have everything. Oh my god, even all kinds of noodles. Jin ramen. Spicy. Kalguksu. Not like Korea hot, it's not that humid. Sun is strong though. Yeah. Yeah, we obviously have been. Hey, but this is my undie. Hey, why did you give undie first? Because it's all your damn underwear. <laughs> anyway, yes, we've been enjoying our relaxing Canada life. Kuho went out with Minho the other day, like you slept overnight and you had like a boys day. While you were gone, I went to Costco with my parents, like Canadian Costco. Man, I missed it. What are we doing today? Just like chilling? Yeah, chilling. I think tomorrow we're gonna try to do like a little bit of shopping at the mall or something. Nothing like huge. Oh my god, the sun is so hot. Yes, I'm already burning. Whew. There, oh, I miss doing this though. Barbecue is ready to start. My dad just got this new barbecue. Before I we like came it. This year. Yeah. This is like a typical Canadian barbecue. Uh -huh. Very typical. So, we're gonna have Kilo's very, very favorite barbecue chicken thighs. Wow. All dry. Good. Take the spiders out of them. <laughs> okay.
I've never found a one. One. <laughs> Shut up, Sarah. <laughs> okay, you have found his ideal phone case. How, how am I gonna put it in my pocket? <laughs> It'll stick out like that. Hello, guys. Hey guys. We just came back from the mall. We're just browsing. We wanted to actually have like a mini talk mm -hmm. after that because we do get a lot of questions about where we buy our clothes mm -hmm. and shoes and stuff. Right. A lot of people assume that when we come to Canada, especially me, I must stock up on absolutely everything while I'm here because I am really tall, like I'm five, nine and a half and I have big feet. So a lot of people think, oh, this is the only place where I can buy clothes that fit me. Right. But that's actually not the case, surprisingly. Mm -hmm. But in Korea, we don't really go shopping physically. Yes. We order everything online at least 80% mm -hmm. we go shopping online yeah. all the time the only thing I actually go by uh, physically is my underwear because I have to check funny story when QO comes to Canada the underwear does not fit him last year yeah I tried to find <laughs> one and then the medium size is too big small size too tight yeah so I have to throw out all nine of them and for me all Korean underwear is too small our country's underwear don't fit one another <laughs> So yeah, we do mostly shop online. Some of the top stores for online we shop at are like G Market mm -hmm. or 11th Street. Those are like Korean based online stores. Sometimes the users will ship abroad, but it depends. And Coupang as well. I yeah. believe they only ship within Korea. Coupang usually for groceries. Face, like skincare right. stuff. Mm -hmm. I get it there. For clothes or shoes for me online, I'll go to like Zara or Forever 21. Mm -hmm or list mm -hmm. which has a lot of different options and brands mm -hmm. so i mean if you are a foreigner like me living in korea and your body type is kind of you know a little different you're taller gangly got big feet there's hope for you but yeah so that's pretty much like you know our shopping secrets i really don't buy that many clothes when i come to canada i actually buy most of them online while we're in korea but yeah we just thought we'd have a little shopping discussion. So we're just going to kind of chill and enjoy the rest of our day. It's nice, I wanna take a nap. That crow has been like mocking us the whole time. We don't have any food for you. Oh my god, they're big. Yeah, they're hey. coming towards us. They want food. They're we don't hungry. Have, they're, no, look how huge they are. They're definitely getting more than enough food here. Oh, all, no, look, no, 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 no. Look, look, they're all coming. Okay. Bye bye. <sighs> mm. Smells good, right? Canada smell. It started to rain a little bit, but it's kind of refreshing actually. We are gonna go see what animals they have this year. He came right over. He's a barn cat, so he probably catches all the mice in there. Hi there. What a cute little guy. He just came right up to us. Hi. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> now we're gonna probably waste another 15 minutes here. Very friendly. Umbrella time. So this place has been here for I mean, probably a couple hundred years mm -hmm. and they kept this old house and the barn. So it's a very historical site in this area. 
That's Why does it smell bacon? Because they sell food in there. It's actual barbecue. Yeah. In there. I knew about this spot. Perfect place to take shelter. They grow all these vegetables here. All right, it's slowing down, so we're going to emerge. Look how fresh that lettuce looks and that like green onion. I want to like wrap some salad in there and like just like straight from the garden. <laughs> You're a true Korean. I know. Wow. Yeah. Shall we go in the actual barn? Yeah. Baby cow. <laughs> Her name is Licorice. See? So the animals we saw in the barn, they're not always in there. It's just because today is kind of rainy. Usually they're in there. So they have lots of space to kind of graze and feel the wind. That's how they do laundry. They like rub the clothes against that in the kerosene lamp. They use in 1800s? Yep. Yeah, you're too tall the for this. Even the ceiling, yeah. It was built in the late 1780s. We came here two years ago, actually. Yeah. I've always wanted to use one of these. <laughs> We need more dill. Oh no. <laughs> Hello guys. guys. We're just signing off. It's already been like a week and a half since we came to Canada. Oh my god. I know. Time it goes, flies. It does. It goes by really, really fast. Yeah. Yeah, we just finished eating. We're probably gonna eat some more. <laughs> dessert this time. Cheesecake from Costco. We have had like no self-control and it's only been like a week and a half. We had to pace ourselves. Right, we have to go to the beach soon. So. Yeah. Anyway, if you enjoy the video and if you enjoy our videos in general, please, please like, subscribe and share. It really helps us a lot. Yes. All right, so enjoy your weekend. We'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.